Okay, now you're going to do the fifth layer and a smidget of the sixth layer. I think this part's kind of confusing. So you're gonna find your fifth layer pieces, which look like this. One should not be glued. And first of all, you just place all the ones that are glued. First one goes there, this one goes here. This one goes back here. And you know, right now I'm not gonna place this last one for me. Um for you, um yeah, don't replace the the last pieces that aren't supposed to be connected yet. Um then um what you're gonna do is you're gonna take your shell piece that we took out a while ago and you're gonna make sure that this bump right here is aligned with this bump in here. Oops. You can like take this out just to look at it. You can see it's facing that way. So for me, um, this is the correct way. Okay, um, now you're gonna take your piece. Ah, oops. Sorry about that. Okay. So you're going to take this piece and you're going to take the piece that was on here that's not attached, which for me I don't have right now. And you're going to put it right there. Okay. And then you're going to hold it there. And you're going to gently push it push this into your core and this might be kind of hard to do because it has to link into these pieces here which should be glued so I guess you could just do that and then holding the okay sorry this is kind of last minute but um what you're actually going to do is um the shell piece and then this piece and then the small piece on top which isn't there right now which is supposed to be detach from this piece. Um, you're just gonna set that aside for right now so that you just have this. And then you're gonna take the rest of your um, layer pieces and you're gonna insert them. So um, I have mine all backwards right now. Well over here where I, store, where I was trying to keep them organized. So anyway, um, this piece you just slide them in like that and for me this piece will be no this piece and just we have to probably place that piece first and th that's this piece I think and just put it in like that and Finally, this piece. Okay, so they're all in. And now, all right, now that they're all in, you're gonna make sure that, um, like this piece is, you have the separate piece, the separate, this small separate piece that's rounded off is right there on the shell piece. And then this, this, the extra block is just sitting around somewhere. And make sure you have this piece handy that isn't glued. Okay, first of all, um, you're going to take this, the one that is not, um, the one that has this small piece on top and has this glued and just filled piece on the bottom and with the shell piece. And you're going to with with this somewhat piece on top, you're gonna fit it in there, and then take your screwdriver and lock it in. Oops, I had it set the wrong way. It might be kind of hard to get at it.
No, but I knocked the camera down. And make sure not to screw it in too loose or too tight, or else you're gonna have to use a different core because it's gonna like break. I already that already happened to me. So make sure it's just right. So um, that's pretty good. Okay, now you're probably wondering how you're gonna get the rest of the pieces in when you have small piece right there which I don't have right there and every all the core pieces are locked in and everything well um right now first of all um you're gonna insert these three pieces and for me they're gonna fit in pretty easily but for you maybe not so easily under the small piece that's supposed to be right here for me I can just like put them in because there is no small piece okay and but you have to try and fit them under the small piece that would be right there. Okay, now you're really close to being done. Now, you should only have one piece left, which is this piece. Of course, with that small piece on there, because it should be right there. But this other block make, made up of four pieces, as you can see here. Now, what you're going to do is you're going to turn this top layer sideways, which should look really cool. If it, You should be pretty happy that it turns if you made it this far. Um, and this piece should be now right there. And you're going to take some of your super glue and you're going to put it on this piece. And just put like a lot on. Not a super lot, but you know, more than just like a small drop. Maybe like three small drops or four. Then you're going to take your block and you're going to first put it on kind of like this. If, um, 2D view like that. And it's kind of hard for me to really demonstrate with this because I have a piece glued on. But, um, so you're going to just put it on like that. And then you're just going to push it inward so that it forces the piece that you're gluing it onto, the small piece, against the, against the back, against these pieces. So that it's, like, perfectly aligned, too, with, like, with these pieces. So, you're just going to, you know, put it on and then move it back so that it forces the piece back with the glue as it dries. It's kind of hard to really demonstrate it, just like, you know, once you have the glue on, just put it like this and then slide it back so, for, so that it glues correctly. And then turn it back, and you should have a, an assembled, two, fully functional 2x2x6. Two two just be careful not to turn it too much, because um, it could actually snap, because you have a lot of loose pieces without stickers on them, and they it's happened to me a lot, and they just like fall apart, and and the pieces like these ones, they this part comes off, and it's really frustrating because you have to cut this off, and then make a new one, and sand it down, and then glue it back on, and then repeat the whole process again. So just be careful, and thanks for watching.